What's going on guys? It's your boy KJB and we're back for the big G Fuel Boxing Part 2. So, um, as you guys can see, I was playing some Zambies in Call of Duty Cold War. And speaking of uh, Zambies in Call of Duty Cold War, you guys can add me. Um, I'll have my gamer tag in the description down below. We can play Warzone, Zombies, Multiplayer, pretty much anything. Uh, I want to connect with my subscribers more because I feel like I just don't really like do enough for you guys. Um... Oh, speaking of you guys, being the amazing human beings you are, we hit 87, I forgot, I think it's it 87 or 86, well, we hit 80 subscribers a few days ago, and then after that, it just started, like, shooting up, so thank you guys, new subscribers, my name's Kaden, I do G Fuel content on YouTube, um, so if you guys like this channel, uh, feel free to stay, uh, if you don't, you can unsubscribe, that's totally fine. Um, but if you want to stay, turn on notifications because we upload almost every day now. Um, I didn't upload yesterday because I honestly wasn't feeling it too much. Uh, and plus I just, yeah, just wasn't feeling it. So we have a different shaped package, but it's the same amount of tubs, I believe. And then I got too excited while opening up these two shakers. These are the hive season shakers. I did get two of them. These shakers sold out in like five minutes. So if you got one sick if you didn't uh there i don't know if they'll be re-releasing re but yeah this shaker cup is just super cool there's the b right there of course then we have the black g fuel logo then we have the lid with the white uh top then we have the black filter so i did score two hive season shakers which is really really cool um and then we have the big boy the big man uh nothing like some uh we do have phase x which my top five g fuel flavors um and g fuel tips video will be coming out shortly um i'm working on the list of stuff to go over um so we'll be doing a video uh like that before 2020 ends oh phase x is so good yeah the mini guy now yeah this is like a, a semi big box but at the same time, it's kind of a semi-small box, I guess. It's just, like, weirdly shaped. Oh, yep, yeah, and I definitely cut it from... I'm definitely doing this from the wrong way. There we go, we got it. Again, we're going to put the package on the ground so, like, I can just show you guys the tubs without having a huge box obstructing the lid. Yep, yeah, another doodle sticker, bro! There, there's, there's a very nice amount in here. Like, no cap. Okay, so we did get two more tubs of the classified G Fuel flavor. I didn't know how limited this flavor was going to be, so now I have three tubs of classified and all. Turns out the flavor did re-release again, so if you guys missed it, uh, you can actually go get it again now, which is kind of, you know, I feel stupid because this flavor is not even my... Anyways, so yeah, two, two uh, tubs of classified right there. I think it's still going to be limited, but right now there's just like a restock. Next, we did get two more tubs of peach cobbler. Now, actually, I do enjoy this flavor a lot. Um, in milk, though, like I said, in water, it's kind of garbage. But in milk, it's goaded. So yeah, two more tubs of peach cobbler. Um, peach cobbler is seasonal, so you can only get it once a year. Um, hence why I got two tubs, um, and because it's kind of the Black Friday exclusive why I got it. Next we got Watermelon, which I have not done a review on Watermelon yet, so that's pretty cool. I'll be able to get Watermelon out now. Uh, Dumb Melon Mint did get vaulted, but regular Watermelon did not get vaulted, so that's pretty, pretty cool. I can do a flavor review of this one now. Next up, we did get, ah, uh, okay. This one, this one... I don't really un battle juice. My least favorite G Fuel flavor of the lineup. We got a tub of. Uh, why did we? Cause one, I'm a G Fuel user, but and two, uh, I want to give this flavor another try. You know, in the tub, the pack is garbage, but. There has been a trend of where tubs and packets taste different. So maybe, just maybe, I'll like this flavor. I, I probably w won't end up liking this flavor because Battle Juice sucks. Um, again, G Fuel, I love you so much, but this flavor is I don't like this flavor at all. Uh, if you will go watch my Battle Juice video, 
uh, you can just see uh, that I did not enjoy that very much. So yeah, Battle Juice, not my most favorite flavor of the lineup. Uh, yeah, definitely not my favorite of the lineup. Definitely my least favorite of the lineup, but uh, maybe, just maybe. Next, we got another one that I don't got yet. We do have this, ooh, this tub's weird. What the f <laughs> This tub's weird. The lid's like so much, so, what is this? Okay, well, you saw it. So, Rage and Gummy Fish. Now, I don't have this flavor in a tub. I've had it in the packet. I've had it maybe twice since I started drinking G Fuel about a year ago. I've had this flavor twice, uh, which twice being in a packet. Um, it's it's all right. You know, it's definitely not a daily drinker, uh, but maybe it'll taste better in the tub. Just maybe, maybe. But the tub does look sick, though. I, I really do like the tub. Because I've been drinking so much of this flavor, I decided to get another tub. Uh, which now makes I have three tubs. Uh, we have Phase X. Now, uh, Phase X, uh, I'm going to spoil it to you guys. I believe Phase X is my third favorite flavor right now. This flavor, you guys, is banging. I love this flavor so much. Like, at first, when I tried this flavor, um, and, you know, I didn't rate it the highest, and, you know, I didn't give it as much credit as I, as I should have. But this flavor is legit a Frost Gatorade flavor. It's fire, and I love it so much. It's very good. Um, yeah, it's just a really, really good Frost Cherry, some pineapple in there. This flavor is goaded. This flavor is so good. And the rating that I have it now at is a 9 out of 10 because it's just so good. In fact, it's so good that um, I'm almost out of my first tub, as you guys can see. The powder's all the way down there. I've had this flavor so much. And, oh, that's, in fact, what's in this. Uh, because, yeah, this flavor is so good. Uh, you can drink it at any time of the day. It doesn't matter if it's in the morning, afternoon, or at night. I can have this flavor uh, with breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Uh, staying with peach iced tea, but peach iced tea still does have that edge. But, yeah, this is the second part of the BOGO. This is what I got um, in my second part of my BOGO. Uh, is it a lot? Yeah, but at the same time, I'm a G Fuel YouTuber, so, mm -mm. so, if you guys enjoyed this video, if you guys, if you guys enjoyed this video, please feel free to leave a like, um, and if you're new here, why not subscribe, because that's a pretty good idea, uh, if you do ask me, it's a decent idea, but yeah, subscribe, uh, ring the, uh, turn the little bell, I'm not a YouTuber, I'm not even a YouTuber, I'm not, like, uh, but yeah, ring that little bell, so you know when I upload, because whenever it is, it's goaded. So, yeah, these are all the tubs I got. Um, if you want to see them, just recap them, because I'm not going to recap it again. I'm not going to make this uh, thing very long. So, yeah, have a great rest of your day. Stay healthy. I love y'all.